What is the essence of what you're going to teach these guys out on the lakes? We're going to talk about foam, free open access medical education. What about it? Um, how amazing it is, um, what is available to them in terms of resources online, um, the knowledge translation and how fast research is changing and happening, and um, then we're going to have a little bit of fun too. Good. So what are the, what are the top tips for, uh, from Ashley Liebig when it comes to accessing foam made? Um, I think it's just engaging and being part of a conversation, having the courage to have your voice heard on Twitter, um, participating in uh, the blogs and uh, commentary, reading as much as you can and educating. The th same thing in life, always be nice. Always be nice? Just be nice. Okay. So it's not very hard. Okay. How do you know when uh, somebody is worthy of being listened to? Well, I think um, just like you would in any academic or journal, you would look at the credentials of the individual, what they've published. Anything that you find online, you should obviously um, do your own research into. We don't just, every journal that we read, we look at the study and whether or not it was valid. Um, so those, those same things apply in social media and, uh, and foam. We, we take a look at uh, what our resources are and where they are. We don't just take everyone for their word. Be skeptical always. So do you ever uh, go out for dinner and find yourself sort of checking your phone made and, you know, going through your Twitter feeds and, you know, sort of losing concentration on the person opposite you? Um, no, because if I'm going to dinner, I just, we shut the phone off. The phones get shut off? Yeah, well, I mean, unless I'm with you guys and then we just tweet each other. <laughs>